Imagine by Juan Felipe Herrera, illustrated by Lauren Castillo. If I picked chamomile flowers as a child in the windy fields and whispered to their fuzzy faces, imagine. If I let tadpoles swim across my hands in the wavy creek, imagine. If I jumped up high into my poppy's army truck and left our village of farm workers and waved adios to my amiguitos, imagine. If I let the stars at night paint my blanket with milky light with shapes of hungry birds while I slept outside, imagine what you could do. If I helped mama feed the hopping chickens and catch the crazy turkey in the front yard of our new village, imagine. If I walked through the evening forest at the top of a mountain with a silverly bucket to fetch water from the next town, imagine. If I moved to the winding city of tall bending buildings and skipped to a new concrete school I had never seen, imagine. If I opened my classroom's wooden door not knowing how to read or speak in English, imagine. If I practice spelling words in English by saying them in Spanish like pencil for pencil, imagine. If I collected gooey and sticky ink pens because I loved how the ink flowed like tiny rivers across soft paper, imagine. If I grabbed a handful of words I had never heard and sprinkled them over a paragraph so I could write a magnificent story, imagine. If I stood up in a school far away from where I lived and sang for the first time in front of class, imagine. If I started to write a poem on a skinny paper pad after school as I walked on the wide sidewalk and then finished it when I got home, imagine. If I picked up my honey-colored guitar and called out my poem every day until it turned into a song, imagine. If I gathered many words and many more songs with both of my hands and let them fly over my mesa and turn them into a book of poems, imagine. If I stood up wearing a robe in front of my familia and many more on the high steps of the Library of Congress in Washington, D.C. and read out loud and signed my poetry book like this, Poet Laureate of the United States of America. Imagine what you could do.